no part of the tree shall be nearer than decimeter from the nearest live conductor and the right answer is 4 meter permanent way staff are advised to keep clear of the track and avoid contact with the rails when an electrically hauled train is within and that is 200 50 meter. When unloading rails along the track, care shall be taken to ensure that rails don't touch each other to form a continuous metallic mass of length greater than and that is 300 meter. When joggled face plate are removed for the deployment of track machine, a SR dash shall be imposed till such time the joggled face plate are refixed and that is 50 kmph. The shortest distance between the gauge faces of rails of a track is called track gauge. The level difference between the two rails on a sleeper of a track is called and it is called cross level. The total traffic carried on a line is expressed as and it is expressed as GMT. GMT full form is the full form of GMT is gross million tons. Height of 52 kg IRS rail is dash mm and the right answer is 156 mm. Height of 60 kg UIC rail is the height of 60 kg UIC rail is 172 mm. Bottom flange width of 52 kg IRS rail is dash mm and it is 136 mm. Bottom flange width of 60 kg UIC rail is the bottom flange width of 60 kg UIC rail is 150 mm. Weight of 1 meter length of 52 kg IRS rail is and that is 51.89 kg per meter. Weight of 1 meter length of 60 kg UIC rail. The weight of 1 meter length of 60 kg UIC rail is 60.34 kg. Group A route is classified the, with the speed up to and that is 160 kmph, up to 160 kmph. Group B route is classified with a speed up to and it is 130 kmph. Group D special routes are classified with a speed up to. The group D special does not exist now. Group D route is classified with a speed up to and it is a speed up to 110 kmph. Group E route is classified with a speed up to. This route classification does not exist now. Suburban section of Mumbai, Delhi, Chennai and Kolkata are classified as and it is classified as group C routes. Full form of ERC. Full form of ERC is elastic rail clip. Full form of GRSP. The full form of GRSP is grooved rubber sole plate. All the new AT welds, welded joints, shall be ultrasonically tested as early as possible. In any case, not later than 30 days. Joggled face plate with clamps or too far in bolts on good AT belt shall be provided on curves 3 degree or sharper. 
joggled fish plates with far in bolts shall be provided on 80 wells which have undertaken traffic equal to or more than dash percentage of a stipulated fatigue life in a GMT life of the rail and that is 50 percent. Joggle fish plate with clamps or too far in bolts on good 80 wells shall be provided on banks having a height dash meter or more and it is 5 meter or more. Joggle fish plated, joggle fish plate with clamps or too far in bolts on good 80 weld shall be provided on bridge having a length of waterway as 100 meter or more and an approach up to and it should be given on an approach up to 100 meter length. A thermit welded welding done in situ shall be joggled face plated with two clamps and supported on wooden blocks of length dash until tested as good by USFD. So generally the size of the wooden block is 300 mm into 450 mm. Maximum bit of the rail profile grinder including generator is maximum weight of the rail profile grinder including generator is and it is approximate 80 kg. Maximum grinding time for grinding of 80 belt with rail profile grinder and it takes about 15 minutes. Minimum manpower required to operate rail profile weld grinder is and it needs two person, one unskilled and one unskilled. One meter a straight edge is used for. Check the vertical and lateral clearance, right? Alignment of the rail ends both laterally and vertically, it is also right. Check the straightness of the rail ends, it is also right. So all of the above is the right answer. Traffic can be allowed only after dash minutes have elapsed after welding of 80 in a welding of rail joint and it needs 30 minutes. A minimum traffic block of dash minutes is required for one joint to ensure good quality of welding. So from the given option it is 60 to 70 minutes. Welding of rail joint work should be carried out within and it should be under the protection, it should be under the caution order, it should be under the line block. So all the three is required. Cut rail renewal work should be carried out within. So cutting of rail in the during the renewal work it should be done under the protection, caution order and line block. So all the above is the right answer. AT welding of rail joint work, banner flag should be placed at a distance of dash meter from the worker spot and it should be 600 meter. AT welding of rail joint work, detonator should be placed at a distance of dash meter from the worker spot and it should be 1200 meter. Protection of track for works which are completed on the same day is done by and it is done by HS flag, banner flag and with detonators. Protection of track for works which will be carried for more than one day is done by and it is done by engineering fixed indicators. Life of a detonator is though so the normal life of a detonator is five years. Life of a detonator can be extended up to a maximum of dash years with certain test and it can be extended up to the eight years. 
क्वेश्चन इंडिकेटर बोर्ड फॉर स्पीड स्टॉप डेड लॉन्ग ड्यूरेशन वर्क सेल बी प्लेस्ड एट अ डिस्टेंस ऑफ एंड इट शुड एट अ डिस्टेंस ऑफ ट्वेल्व हंड्रेड मीटर स्पीड डिस्ट्रिक्शन बोर्ड शुड बी प्लेस्ड एट अ डिस्टेंस ऑफ डैश मीटर फ्रॉम द वर्क स्पॉट एंड इट इज थर्टी मीटर लेंथ ऑफ चेकरिल एट लेवल क्रॉसिंग सेल बी सो इट इज जनरली ब्रिथ ऑफ द रोड प्लस टू मीटर वन मीटर ऑन आदर साइड चेकरिल क्लियरेंस टू बी प्रोवाइडेड एट लेवल क्रॉसिंग द डिस्टेंस इज फिफ्टी वन टू फिफ्टी सेवन mm the amount by which one of the rail is raised with the reference of the other rail uh, other rail of a track is called and it is called super elevation what is used to measure the distance between the gauge faces of a rail of a track at 13 to 15 mm below the top of the rail from the nominal gauge and the equipment used gauge cum level instrument 